All right, so let's solve a problem which appeared in JMA in 2025. In this question, we have been asked to uh, find the set of all the seven digit numbers which can be found with the digits one, two, three, such that their sum is 11. Okay, so in this question, like what we understand here is that with the, we have to just use one, two, and three. So let's look at like there are seven digit numbers, right? So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So what if I just put one in every place? So if I put one, 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 for example, in every place, then what I get is seven, okay? So I don't want seven, I want 11, right? So I start looking for from this perspective of ones and start reducing the number of ones and see that whether we can reach to that level, right? So what if I reduce, so if I use all the ones, I will not be able to get 11. So that is not desirable, so it is removed. Now the second case is I use six ones. If I use six ones, then I could use either a two or a three. So let's look at this. So this is not desirable. Let's say one, two, three, four, five, six. I make use of six ones. Then what is uh, that I can make use of here? Two, then it will become eight. Or I can use three, then it will become nine. This is also not desirable. So this is also not useful. Now I come to the next case, which is one, 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 one. Now I come to five. Now I need what six more so 11 minus 5 6 right so i could reach to 6 this way right i can just have 3 and 3 right so then i can reach to 11 so that is fine so this is one but the permutation can happen in many ways so i'll come to this but this is one of the case which is fine with me right so um now there is a case which is actually involving the like what we are saying is the five ones now uh, is there any other possibility if we can involve five ones, right? So, um, looks like there is none because maximum I can make use of three, right? Now, what we can use is four ones. Let's say one, two, three, four. Now, if I use four ones, then I get 11 minus four, which is seven. Now, I have got seven. So, seven can be reached like this, two, two, and three, right? So, this again, permutation is fine. We will look at the permutation, but this is also a valid case, which is making it four plus uh, four, eight plus three, 11. So that also will work out, right? Now, what else can happen, right? So let's say if I can make use of, um, so three ones, one, two, three. Now, 11 minus three is eight. So now eight, is there, which again, I can make use of this, right? Two, 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 right? So this is also a possibility, right? Now let's look at, can I make use of two ones, right? If I try doing this, then what will happen? 11 minus two, which will be nine. And then nine, how can I reach nine? Even if I try using all the twos, I will not be able to reach either threes, of course, will not work out. So I think from here on, things will not work out. So. All we have got is three, these three valid cases. So we'll just look at the permutation of it and see that whether any answer is matching. So in this case, so I've got factorial seven base to arrange. So I'm looking at case number one. So case number one is having factorial seven ways to arrange them, but there are five identical ones. So factorial five divided by factorial two. So what will this give me? This give me seven into six into factorial five divide by factorial 5 into factorial 2. So this is gone, this is gone. So the, I get 21 here. Then I got a second case, which is this one. In this case, factorial 7 divided by factorial 4, factorial 2. Factorial 4 for 4 ones, factorial 2 for this one. So then I get factorial 2 for this case, right? So 7 into 6 into 5 into factorial 4 divided by factorial 4 into 2. So factorial 4 is gone, this is gone. So this will give me 105. Now case 3, my case 3 is this one. So I've got factorial 7 divided by factorial 3 and factorial 4. So this gives me 7 into 6 into 5 into factorial 4 divided by factorial 3 into factorial 4. So factorial 3 is 6 and this is 4. So then I get 35. Okay, so this is all the cases which is looking like. So we'll sum up. We'll get 105, 35, and 21. When I sum up, I get 
one over here and then six over here and then this so i get 161 and that is what will be my answer so 161 will be my answer for this question okay yeah if you've got any questions do ask me in the comment section below and i'll be happy to answer your queries thank you so much for watching this video have a good day